fact, even in the highest levels, you have discrimination. Yes. I was surprised that one major institution in the country, this one was not gender, but still somehow is connected, required that everybody should come with a, an HIV uh, report okay. test. Yes. And guess who were required? <laughs> Housemen and women. That is, doctors who, were, who had finished training and were now in the process of you know, doing service. How do you require such people to bring HIV test report? <laughs> Unbelievable. These, these are the issues. And so my recommendations are as follows. We should have sexual harassment policies popularized in, in the country, in our districts, in all workplaces. It is not as if it is it's a requirement now under the National Anti-Corruption Action Plan. Because we've seen sexual harassment as a, a basis for protecting women, because that is also corruption. When people d demand your, your body, bodily services before you can get promotion, before you can even be employed, and there is no legal framework out of which you can challenge that person, then what happens? It's, 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 it's a problem of discrimination mostly against women.